earlier today. Uh, Republican state legislators in Florida proposed today a bill that would ban abortion before many women know if they are <coughs> even pregnant, virtually eliminating a woman's right to make health care decisions about her own body. This ban would prevent not just the nearly 4 million Florida, Florida women of a productive age from accessing abortion care after six weeks, but would also impact the nearly 15 million women of reproductive age who live in states across the South with abortion bans and would no longer be able to rely on Florida as an option to access care. We know that these bans are already having a devastating impact on women's health. In a case filed today in Texas, we unfortunately heard devastating firsthand accounts of women's lives almost lost after they were denied the health care they needed. Horrifying details of needless pain, all because of extreme efforts by Republican officials to take away a woman's ability to make her own health care decisions. Politicians like Governor DeSantis and Abbott espouse, quote, freedom for all unquote, while directly attacking the freedom to make one's own health care decisions. Their rhetoric doesn't come without consequences here. The stories told today in, in 2023 in the United States of America are shameful and completely unacceptable. Like the overwhelming majority of Americans, the president and the vice president believe women should be able to make health care decisions with their own doctors and families free from political interference, period. They are committed to protecting access to reproductive care and continuing to call on Congress to restore the protections of Roe v. Wade in federal law. 